Hey guys, what's up? It's Greggles here from the Greggles and Dan Show on YouTube. Uh, today we're going to look at a torrent program called uTorrent and how you can use uTorrent on your NVIDIA Shield TV. And just to let you know, I did have to sideload it because it doesn't show up in the uh, Google Play Store for the NVIDIA Shield TV. So I had to go find the APK on Google. I just searched uh, uTorrent APK and I uh, downloaded it to my computer and then I put it onto a thumb drive and put the thumb drive into the NVIDIA Shield TV and then I installed it that way. So let's get this loaded up. There it is right there, uTorrent. So I, so with this program, um, I need a mouse plugged in because I'm trying to use my controller right now and it doesn't really work. So um, it has a few things. You have your, all your torrents right here. You have Discover, which looks like you can download some BitTorrent things. Looks like, I guess this is music. Um, you also have your settings, which there's an upload limit, Wi-Fi net, wi networks only, and some different uh, ports in here. I'm using version uh, 2.1849, and you can upgrade to Pro, which I'm not going to do that. All right, so now we will... Uh, go to a browser so we can download a torrent. So I'll go back to side load launcher. And I already have a website loaded up for uh, torrents. It's uh, everything on this site's legal now. It's called Mini Nova. So <clears throat> all this music and stuff on here is legal. Everything on here is legal. They used to be a uh, non they used to be more like the Pirate Bay, but then they got in trouble, so now they're more like uh, just their normal site. So they have different categories, books, movies, games. Uh, things like that. So you got your books, for instance. Let's just check out audiobooks real quick. Uh, as you can see, probably nothing you've ever heard of, but whatever. So we will go, I'll just go to music. I'll go to ambient. And then, so this site has pop-ups, which kind of suck with the Chrome browser because I don't have, it's not blocking some of them. So sometimes I have to go back a few times in order to get to it. So I'll click, I'll try this one right here. And I'm gonna hit download torrent. And then it says open with, I'm gonna choose uTorrent. <clears throat> I'll do always. And then as you can see, so it's gonna download uh, to this location, storage, emulated, download. I wonder if we can change that. Go up, up, let's see if we can get to the, now we'll go keep going up. So USB, let's try, USB drive, which I don't know which one that is, so it'll go up again. SD card, maybe. I don't even know which SD card that is, because I got, obviously, they count. This must be the regular one. Yeah, that's the regular one, so I'll choose SD card one. And I guess you just use that, okay. So it's 91 megabytes, files to download 11. Actually, you know what? I'll just put it in the download folder just to be safe, just to show that it will download. So, SD card, download, <clears throat> hit OK. All right. Choose Add. And then let's see if this actually works. I haven't tried this yet. So here it is. So it looks like it's... Uh, Looks like it's working, it's about 10% done. <laughs> My battery's low, I'm not even running out of battery. That's what's, what's funny about that. <laughs> so this is definitely working. You can definitely torrent from here for sure. So I'll let this thing run. Dog was barking, so I didn't want you guys to here, that should probably bark again, but it looks like it's definitely working, so it looks like it works. Um, we'll wait till at least one of these tracks finishes so we can look in the downloads folder to see if it shows up there.
and I don't know if this app will run uh, if you close it. That's another thing we can test out. Let's click details. So we're getting 152 up, 134 down. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's right. Um, two of three seeds, estimated time, seven minutes, 35 seconds. This is going pretty, pretty slow for a torrent, but whatever. It's downloading all the tracks, looks like. So as a test, what we'll do is, it's definitely downloading, so I'm gonna leave the app, close the app, 86, 71, 26, we'll see if those percentages change when I leave this app, or if they stop. We'll go into uh, ES File Explorer, go into Downloads, and you can see it's downloading right here, so this definitely works. And then let's go back to the app, the torrent app. And see if that stayed. So yeah, it's definitely it, so it runs in the background, which is cool. You can so you can play your games and do everything you guys want and let this thing torrent in the background. You could use this, you know, you don't even need a computer anymore. You can torrent right from this and let it run on your TV, have all your media on this cuz this can do USB drives and different things like that. So Definitely works, guys. If you have any questions or comments, uh, leave it there. Um, if you uh, like the video, please give it a thumbs up. And we will see you guys next time. If you want to see any uh, other videos or games or apps, let us know and we will try it out, guys. Thanks. Have a great day.